Hey guys, welcome to my playthrough of Silent Hill 4, The Room. I've never played this game before. The last Silent Hill I played was Silent Hill 3 a couple months ago. So this is the next one in the series. Thank you very much uh, to one of my generous subscribers for donating this game. Uh, one thing I want to talk about real quick. Um, some of you that follow me on Facebook may know that recently when I was playing Beyond Two Souls, uh, my backwards compatible refurbished PS3 completely died and got the yellow light of death after only owning it for a couple months. So uh, this is actually being played on a new PS3 that's also backwards compatible that one of my friends uh, exchanged to me and he's had it for like, you know, the past five years and never had a problem. So I thought, well, I'll take a chance on it so I can play, you know, these PS2 games in a, a better uh, resolution than 480i on the uh, PS2. So with that out of the way, we're going to start. Now I've heard very mixed things about this game. We'll do this on normal difficulty. Some people say it's, you know, one of the scariest Silent Hill games in the series. Others say it's complete crap. So I guess we'll find out. It was two years ago that Henry Townsend moved into room 302 of South Ashfield Heights an apartment building in the medium-sized city of Ashfield. Henry was happy and enjoying his new life. Kind of strange that we don't get a voiceover here. But five days ago, something strange happened. He began to have a recurring dream each night. One other thing. He couldn't leave room 302. Interesting. So I've heard that this game takes place all in one room. I don't know how true that is, but so far it's looking consistent with what we're seeing. Oh shit, is this a first person view? Wow. Like I said, I've never played this game before, so I I was completely unaware. Huh. All right. What the hell? What was that? There's a little eye. What's with this room? That's a good question. I, I was under the impression it was your room, so... It's a strange thing to wonder. It's covered in blood and rust. Alright. Well, it seems that when there's an eye icon available, you press X. This is my room, but what the hell has happened to it? Good question. This room, is it really my room? <laughs> You're wondering some very repetitive wonderings, Henry. It's in terrible shape. The air is so heavy, my head hurts. This photo, was it here before? I've seen this lighthouse before. <sniffs> Strange things happening. Okay. Well, uh, can we exit? Sweet. What is that ungodly staticky noise? Oh god. Hi. The door is shut for good. Interesting, it looks like it's melded into the wall there. Hi. I don't feel like washing my hands right now. Dude, very few people ever feel like washing their hands. It's just basic hygiene. I'm not interested in food at all. My head, it hurts. God, what, where's that sound coming from? Also, the first person control leaves a lot to be desired. What is this photo? It's all faded and I can't see it well. Good question. Oh God. Creepy, it looks like a face. Oh, nothing to see here, just a wall face. Don't worry about it. Oh god. Uh, these controls are going to take some getting used to. The window, I can't get it open. God, is it coming from this thing? Shut it off. These books, they're not mine. They're not? Are you sure you're in your apartment? Oh, it's this. Where did this big TV come from? I thought I had a record player here. Interesting. 
What's this? What's this? <laughs> the exact same thing I said. Hello? Oh god. That's no good. Uh-oh. Mr. Wallface is attached to a wall body. Henry, get out of there. Or fall on the ground. You could do that too. Okay, well, th eh, what? <laughs> so it starts off with a strange, creepy dream, just like Silent Hill 3. Just to give some background for those of you that may not know, I am uh, currently playing through the Silent Hill series on this channel. Uh, the only one I had played previous to making this channel was the original Silent Hill on PlayStation, which I didn't like very much, actually. I never finished it. But uh, I played Silent Hill 2 and 3, both playlists you can find under my playlists or in the last link in the description of this video. Oh crap! Is that door chain shut? That's what we saw on the menu. So yeah, um, even though this is a you know 10 year old game or whatever, here let me check the box real quick. I think it's... Oh, it's 1999? Hmm, that doesn't sound right. Maybe 2004? I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, so this is an entirely new experience for me. Oh, man. So hungover. What a dream. Well, all right. Don't get carried away with the cutscenes just yet. What? The? I didn't do that. It forced me to go to the phone. Two, 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 one, nine, five. A lot of twos in that phone number. It's still not working. Dude, he moves slow. What's with his movement? It's like too smooth. Hello? Help me. What? Huh? The cord's cut. Oh. It's the old getting called on a phone that's not plugged in horror trope. Take a look at it, dude. Oh, I don't want to dial anything. I don't. I don't know. Can you call nine one one? Probably not. Call nine one one. Cops knock down your door. Game's over. That would be interesting, wouldn't it? Oh, I maybe maybe I should have looked around my room a little bit. I don't really think about it. Huh. Alright. Ooh, turning is a bitch. Oh. Hey, hello. Henry just likes to be really secure. He's really paranoid about burglars. Five days ago, that's when I first had the nightmare. I haven't been able to get out of my room since then. The phone doesn't work. The TV doesn't work. I can't even get anybody to... Nah. My whole world has suddenly turned insane. My door is chained up. The windows are sealed shut. 
And on top of that, someone chained the door from the inside. How am I going to get out of here? Dude, this is a real problem. Don't go out, Walter. What the hell? What's going on here? What was that? Oh, don't look through the peephole. You don't know what's out there. That's Eileen Galvin from next door. Ooh. Oh, man. Eileen's a hottie. Luck changes before the party. Did she drop her stuff because of all the bloody handprints on the wall? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 bloody handprints. I don't know what significance that holds. Probably none. But there's a note under here that we should take. What's this? Mom, why doesn't you wake up? First letter in your scrapbook. Kid, you've got terrible grammar. Let's address that first. Alright, Walter. I don't know why you have such an authoritarian hold over my life, but... Mom, why doesn't you wake up? So wake is capitalized, and you... Uh, okay, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe there's some sort of code there, who knows. Wait a second. I don't have an inventory. I just noticed that. Okay, we- oh, what's that? Uh... <laughs> I pressed square, and that came up. I don't feel like washing my hands right now. Surprise, surprise. I think... Henry enjoys shunning basic hygiene. It's a photo of me as a kid, and then when I graduated from high school. That's when you graduated high school? From here, it looks like a 19th century photo of dudes in wigs. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Those are graduation caps. Oh, it's a save point. Cool, I'll save it. There's no uh, memory card to insert or remove, so don't worry about it. Alright, so we've been playing for eight minutes. Nice. I'm trying to keep my videos around 20 minutes from now on. Whoa! Hi there! What am I looking at? There's a subway entrance right there. And there's someone out there. Midriff bearing woman. Hmm. She's got red shoes on. Do I know her? That's not Eileen, is it? That's someone else. Okay, so now she's walking into the subway. Hotel, Hotel South Ashfield. Alright, I feel like they're setting up areas for the game. Hotel, subway. Get this, by the way. It looks like a scrap from some book. Man, this thing looks like it was written ages ago. Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world. It exists in a space separate from the world of our Lord. More accurately, it is within, yet without, the Lord's world. Hmm. Unlike the world of our Lord, it is a world in extreme flux, unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, odd creatures, a world only he can control. Anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. How can our Lord forgive such an abomination? This part of the book is too damaged to read. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. The book is too damaged to read anymore. I'm sure all the pertinent information was in the damaged part. Okay, cool. So we got these. Huh. I'll keep those. This is, this is actually very much like the Crooked Man uh, so far. <laughs> finding weird notes around your, your room. It's weird, a few days ago, the power to my TV and my VCR just stopped coming on. Ever since I started having those nightmares. VCR, huh? What? It forced me again. This chest could hold a lot of stuff. What, there's a chest system? Hello, Resident Evil. I don't have anything, though. Toggle. Oh, God. Okay, so 
it looks like. Based on that, what the fuck? What was that? I don't get why these aren't voice acted. It's kind of weird. Alright, so based on that, it looks like that visual is used for inventory or objects, which means that my inventory is going to be on screen. That's really weird. Hi. Anything odd in here? Hello. There's nothing interesting here at the moment. Okay. It's a clothes dryer. I don't need that right now. Nothing in this area has really changed since I moved here. Hmm. Come on. Get. It's a tank filled with oil. Is there anything in here I can use? What was that? Oh. Pick up a screwdriver. There are tools and things on the ground. All right, Henry, I get it. You don't want to pick anything up. You don't even want to take this ladder or anything. That's cool, I guess. I guess we won't do that. Great. Is this ceiling fan on? Hmm. Try it again. Oh, it won't let me look through the peephole. It'll just say, don't go out, Walter. Okay. Um... Why is there so much flickering? I can't tell if that's like a... It's because I'm playing it on the PS3 or, or what. Oh, what the hell? Well, let's go through it. What the hell? <laughs> Great minds think alike, Henry. We have the exact same commentary on these situations. If somebody's in there, that's creepy as shit. I don't like that. I wonder if I can get out this way. Uh, good question, Henry. Um, I don't know. The water has stopped running. Well, no shit. Ooh, what's those sounds? Ooh. It isn't the time for that kind of thing. <laughs> All right. Of course there's no one in the bathtub. Yes, and thank God, because that would be very strange if there was. Oh my God. Oh my God, 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 oh my God. Let's go through, I guess. The sewage pipe's broken too. Pulling the part hanging down? Yes. You got a steel pipe. Yeah, okay, so I was right. What is that? What did I just do? What? Oh, that's... Oh, R1 and L1 is strafe. R2 apparently brings up... I was just wondering if you could wield the weapon, but I guess not. Alright, so when I press square, it's like... Alright, this, this is gonna take some getting used to. I'm not... Yeah, enter the hole. Sure. Oh, God. 